How's it going, everybody? My name is Ty Walters of PiedmontT.com. That's PiedmontTEA.com. Our goal is to start the first organic tea farm in Georgia, and you can visit PiedmontT.com to follow our progress and cheer us on as we get closer to our goal. Anyway, I wanted to bring you a three video series on how we germinate our tea seeds. This will be video one in that series, and our methods are based off of a publication by the College of Tropical Agriculture and Human Resources from the University of Hawaii at Manoa. This publication is available for free download in a PDF version. I will leave a link to that in the description of this video. And this is the basic outline that we followed. I've had a lot of people coming up to me and say, Ty, I have a tea bush, I have tea seeds. What do I do to them to grow my own tea and drink my own tea? So this video is a response to those questions. If you have any questions following the video, leave comments and I'll respond as soon as I can. I really hope you enjoy this video. After you watch the video, and if you think it really rocked, please subscribe to the channel so you can receive our videos immediately after publishing them so you can get the latest information on what we've been up to. Thank you very much and I hope you enjoy. The first step is to use freshly harvested seeds and um, soak them in water. Um, as you can see, these are very fresh seeds, harvested only days ago, but most of them are floating. Um, so it suggests tying them in some kind of permeable cloth that can, uh, kind of like a large tea bag, and then submerged in the water, it would give some weight to it and push them down. Uh, after the soaking period of about 24 hours, uh, the manual instructs to separate the sinkers from the floaters. Apparently the ones that have sunk are higher quality or have imbibed water and thus have a greater chance for germination turning into healthy plants, whereas the floaters, they could be empty or weaker plants or already desiccated. Um... Uh, so this is a great video to show that need to sink the seeds because um, some of these seeds are just floating on top and really not getting any exposure to the water. So we'll check back after we sink them. Okay, it has been roughly three days, which is two days more than is suggested to submerge seeds of Camellia sinensis, sinensis in water, but we're going to check out what happened. And if you can see, it got kind of weird and gross. The water is cloudy. There's no dominant odors, but it doesn't look the best. So something has either leached out of the seeds or started growing. Three days and water is too long. The rest of the seeds are under this bowl. We're going to get them out and sow them immediately. I do notice, though, that some seeds have sank that initially were floating, so that's good. So I have hundreds of seeds in here. What I'm going to do is since the water got kind of funky after three days, too long, I'm going to strain it out in a colander, in a colander in the sink. So I'm going to dump all the water out and I'll just have seeds. It is already 8.23 p.m. and it's kind of dark and scary outside. So I'm probably going to put those in the fridge and then tomorrow morning I'm actually going to sow them in some soil. I have a deeper tray that I could maybe put hundreds in. Um... So I'll have hundreds of seeds in a small tray, a very space-saving technique if you're working with small spaces like I am. I'm going to put it up in a greenhouse and cause it to go. I've already noticed some of my cuttings drying out after a week or so, so I need to keep them moist at least twice a day, and I've been, do not, I've been skipping that. So anyway, that was a side note to self. We're going to sow these tomorrow morning, but here's the draining process. Kind of nasty. It's kind of heavy. I put this over here, and we're gonna drain it. Those big ones are Camellia japonica seeds. Those aren't tea seeds. 
Here they come. So I put some seeds in a sock to submerge them, kind of like a tea bag, a giant tea bag. And it kind of worked. Alright, the seeds are out, and I noticed that there's one bag I need to free some water from, so I'm going to free that, and I'll let them dry out. Here we go. Oh yeah. Are we empty? Okay, that's kind of gross. 